Now quickly show us how to get the fraction bars to open up for us. So if you clicked on the ABC Yeah link from the Google Slides, this website should have popped up for you. If you notice right here in the middle, it's just blank. So we're going to want to click to enable Adobe Flash Player, and it's going to ask you for permission. So it says it wants to run Flash. Go ahead and click Allow. Then the page is going to reload for you. And now we can go in. Right here, it's going to have a quick rundown of what these tools at the top are and some other um, things that you can all use from this website. So go ahead and read those quickly if you'd like. Otherwise, I'll, I'm going to show you quick what the only thing we're going to need today. So go ahead and click X, X on our instructions, and we're going to click on Fractions. So if we just click on fractions, the fraction bars are going to pop up. Um, then you just click to drag the ones that you want to use from the side. Right? After you're done with the problem and you need new fraction, a new space to work here, you just click on new. You want to start new and you're going to click yes and it'll clear out those fraction bars. The other thing that might be handy is to use the pencil tool. You'll notice in some of the videos I use this pencil tool to write my fractions down. So you just click on the pencil and then you got to click and drag your mouse to use it. It's kind of tricky on a trackpad. Oh, didn't mean to scroll down to the bottom there. Kind of tricky on a trackpad, so just do your best. Then if you are done or you messed up and want to try again, you click erase and it just erases it all for you. So again, fraction bars over here for you to use. Click and drag over. New is to start over, brand new. Pencil here to um, trace or you draw anything. Erase to erase it.